Isaac Martins. Isaac Martins um, uh, is a well, is is a veteran. He has been in this uh, in Hollywood for so for so long. You know, we watch screens and always when you see that photography, one of the names is that is very easy to, to, to spot is Isaac Martin. He has really worked on so many things. One thing I've come to appreciate first of all is my my backroom staff, my my technical team. I I have a very sound uh, 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 technical backup. You know, I, I have a DOP Isaac Martins. He he's a veteran. We have come a long way. Uh, when we just contacted him. He said okay, no problem. He was doing it. He, he was doing he was doing something, uh, but he said okay. Uh, since this is a, a technical film, he would like to be a part of it. And, and then he came. He he, had, he really worked with us. He condescended. Um, most of the people that I brought to set were green horns, people that have never actually acted before, uh, the people that we trained, and then uh, and uh, he worked with them to ensure that they still uh, deliver. Ah, my production manager, Chioma Mosu. If I'm going to do another film, I will want Chioma Mosu to be there. Chioma, Chioma really helped our my production. She's a professional. And you know, she's actually a lawyer um, by profession, but she 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 has always had a passion to be to be into the world of uh, creativity. Need to advise the and she brings that every time I'm every time she, it's not it's like my job is not the first she's going to be a production manager she's been production manager in most of the films that I know here in Abuja she's always there as as so she, she's always doing a good job and uh, I, I really she brought in that thing to my script to my to my set and I would like to still have somebody like that in my next movie well every job comes with it one own set of challenges. Uh, well, we had uh, some constraints, some constraints, but um, overall the job, uh, it's an interesting one. I've never had to manage a set of uh, a technical dealer before, this is my first time. So there are so many things that uh, sometimes you get on set and you find out one particular gadget that is needed is not there. I have to drive back and go and find it. Every job comes with uh, challenges. I, I think that even the big budget films will always say that finance is a challenge. <laughs> finance is always a challenge. We don't have enough money for movies. Especially in Nigeria, we don't have enough movies. We don't have people that are willing to sponsor uh, movies. That's it. The police have seen me, they are here. I guess that's it. That's it. Yeah, that's, that's it. it. That's it. again. Deep. They are, they are wives, their children are watching films every day, but they are not willing to make a financial commitment to it. So it's always a challenge to be able to raise money to, to make films. We can, I believe that we can make good films, it's just that we really do not have the money to prosecute it. Props were a very serious challenge. Like I said, this, this is a, high, this is a, a techno thriller. We're going to call it high tech program. We could not call it high tech program because we couldn't achieve what we wanted with gadgetry. Um, there's, there, were, there were so many limitations. We improvised where we could, but yet we're still not able to get the kind of props that would have given this film um, the, the, the lift that it deserved. The person that made a difference in my crew is, um, is um, uh, Monde Makolo. He was actually the utility person in the, in the movie. There wasn't anything that he could not do. There, there's nothing you that uh, Marco did not do. If I needed to have light, he was there. If I needed to have sound, he was there. If I needed to have, it, there, there just was nothing. That in fact, if I needed to have food, he was there. 
So Mark Polo made a great difference in my movie. I, I, I don't think I'll do another movie without him. Desmond, Desmond also came in from Lagos. This but Desmond is uh, he also worked with us before. He acted as a he worked as a continuity man and he did a tremendous job too. So I'm also grateful for him uh, for coming. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, it's well. Okay, this uh, well, some people are some people are, in fact, the uh, Florence Onuma when she saw the script, she challenged me. She said, You are the writer. I said, Yes, yeah. said, Why did Tony die? <laughs> you know, and then I told uh, the only way I pacified her was to tell her there's gonna be a sequel. You know, there are three stages of telling the story one is writing the story, one is um, acting the story, and the third is uh, is editing the story. I, 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 I just feel that I should not be involved in all of it. You are the leader. You are the leader. You are the leader. Come back again. Come back again. You, you, you do. You are. You, let them be the one to react more than you. You are the leader. You understand? Or let these other guys be reacting more than you. Then when you come here, you tell them they bring chairs. Bring chair. Bring chair. I make I hear your voice. Make your voice no day. Talk. Let me hear. Get bring me chairs. chairs. Uh -huh. chairs. Uh -huh. Bring chair. Yeah, bring chair, no be get me chair. Bring chair, 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 bring bring it, huh? They bring it here, see. Bring the two chairs, I bring now. Bring the chairs. Bring chair. You get that one. Put that here. Yeah, I have to pour the things, I have to pour your things. Bring open your own. I'll drop on here. I need all that creativity. Uh, I, I may write something and somebody else comes to interpret it. It might give a perspective that I did not think about. So, um, probably that might be my consideration in making sure that I get a director other than myself. Rolling! Yeah, and action! <laughs> We had the food chain, we had um, we had dolly, we had um, we had a uh, mini jeep, we had um, uh, the the camera that we use is um, uh, Mark Mark three Canon, and uh, that's um, 5D. Um, uh, there's, there's, uh, we, we actually uh, rented uh, our equipment from uh, Paul Appel. Uh, Paul Appel really, really has a lot of equipment and um, we just got the, the whole chain. We got everything for, the, for this movie. We started shooting on the 16th of November and then we, we struck our set on 30th to resume again um, on um, 11th of January 2014. Um, and then we're, we're just closing the set today. Um, uh, today is um, 13th. Today is 13th of uh, of January 2014. It's a